Hey everyone, welcome to Scoop of the Crispy. I'm Mike, bringing you some more World of Final Fantasy. I'm doing all the intervention quests. I got a few of them done. I have to get rid of the five Cogna Lords, and we're taking care of those quests, but I guess the other in intervention quests are required as well, as you can see from these exclamation points. So we're going to be doing the five Cogna Lords, Tom Tome Town Part 1. A locomotive Cogna has been harrying Tome Town, appearing and disappearing seamlessly without rhyme or reason. Salus, Cells, Cellus, Cellus, yeah, Cellus and Sid are at a loss as to how to pin down this elusive foe. But Rain and Lon have an idea. What they need is some good old fashioned train know how. So they go looking for an expert. Oh, the, uh, the, 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 um, they're going for the engineer, the cactuar train engineer. Sid, have you found a pattern yet? Salus is my favorite. Phantom train? So is Terra. Hmm. Still no luck, I fear. It gives new meaning to random. I can tell you that much. <sighs> well, if you can't track it, we'll have to give up for now. A train that traverses the real and unreal. Just our luck. And it only shows itself when it's ready to attack. Not an honorable mirage, is it? Mm. If only we had documentation of how these mirage trains work. Even just some blueprints would do. That's what, Rain? We already know someone who runs a Mirage train! Um... Oh! Cactus guy! He's the That's right! The time to exact my revenge has finally arrived! <laughs> she was really mad at the Cactuar engineer. Because he scared her. She got mad at him, but she couldn't hit him because he's a Cactuar. He's too fast. Cactuar! Your stass is grass! I don't what. You certainly are fired up today, now aren't you, my little giant girl? Um, Rain, I know you're excited about this, but can I come? Look how mad she is. Sure, be my guest. Conductor, if my sister beats you, how about you promise to give us the blueprints to your train? Deal? Oh, we're on. But that's a big if you're talking about. Oh, Here well. Touche. Oh, bring it. Time to knock some humility into that prickly punk. While aiming with the left stick, press circle or triangle buttons to punch, or this square or cross buttons to kick. The time will end if you miss three times or time runs out. Let's go! Show me what you've got! Okay, I'm ready for you. Man, he's quick. Yeah, come on, let's do this. Is it a over? fine try, but not nearly fine shot. enough. Let's go. Show me what you've got. I hate you. You're done. Oh, um. Let me see here. Has to be a pattern. The heck, dude? Okay, here. Let me try kicking him. Is it over? A fine try, but not nearly fine shot. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Go on. Catch me if you can. I dare you. Take this. Why? You're done. Why? No, no, forget it. We're done. Let me just fight him in battle. Wait, that's it? Crap. Once what now? Who's so Okay, good. Part two unlocked. Thanks to the Cactuar conductor's expertise, the twins succeed in luring the cogna to where Squall and Cells were waiting. And Celis. Celeste. This is the place Lon and Rain told us about. Yes, we should be right on time. But I don't get it. How did they figure out where the Phantom Train will appear? Good question. They, they work in strange ways. Very good question. Bingo. Right on schedule. 
Whoa, what the crap, dude? Oh, so much for that. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. Another ghost trip. I can't hear you! You could have just covered your ears. Oh, hey, machine. what's that weird machinery coming out of it? That train must be related to the car. Okay. somehow. It's just the car? Oh, oh, wow. That's no big deal. What are you talking about? Slam. Retaliary missiles? I don't think so, buddy. Oh, I know what to do. I'm gonna go ahead and use water, which he's weak to. Again. Ow, we all fell down. How dare you? Somebody's dead. Somebody's dead. Up. Use the cure. Just keep hitting him. Any more counts. some petty grudge on this guy. It's good. That was good. What the crap, dude? Oh, freak. Oh, that was it. I get so scared because, like, I was playing... What was it? Other games where it's like one hit and they destroy you. I hate those RPGs. Where they're like, ah, just kidding. I'm so powerful. I destroyed you. Like, that doesn't count. Celeste. Wasn't that your name? Yeah, yes, Celeste. That's right. Like Celestial. Celeste. You've got skill. Why don't or you like join Celeste? Seed? Without the T. Sorry. I've no intention of joining a group like Come that. Come on. Again. Doesn't have to be a permanent arrangement. Think it over. We could use someone as tough as you. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'll give it some thought. Anyway, did you notice? We weren't the only forces at play during that battle. Hmm. You're right. I thought it went down more easily than expected. Mm hmm. <laughs> when I see those two, I guess I'll have something else to thank them for. As will I. Ah, there you are. Just so you know, a message is waiting for you at the airship. So, do we're you done? have a moment? Sure. What's up? We've located the King of Bahamut and his lieutenant. What? Dude, really? No. Really, dude? Where are they? The end of the chains. Uh, what now? You already know the towns under Federation control are anchored to chains that extend into the sky. Uh, don't tell me. Oh, I'm telling you. We know now that all of those anchors were fired from the same exact location. Yeah. And that spot must be Bahamut's seat of power. So you're saying their castle, it just floats there? Apparently. If Balam Garden can do it, then why not the Federation? Great! Then we can just sail the up there in our airship! 
Not quite. Oh. Here's the problem. Their castle sits at a much higher altitude. The airship simply isn't built to travel that high. Oh, come on. What do we do? First, you should visit a cathedral. A cathedral? Yes. At the heart of every town that's a part of the Federation. You're certain to find one. Hmm. They're sanctuaries that only admit people chosen as architects. Oh, yeah. And they're much more than that. You need to see it. Once you have, then I'll explain how to get to the castle. Trophio. A cathedral, huh? Where are we supposed to find that? Remember that strange town we visited? The one where you said something felt kind of off? Yeah, the one where you told me we should keep a low profile, right? I bet that was a cathedral in the middle of town. We've seen lots of towns like that, The Sims. We shouldn't have to go that far to find one. Harbor Town. But first, I'm gonna keep doing these. There were there were exclamation points in front of them, which means I gotta keep doing them. So I'm take what now? Who's so? Yeah, see, these still have exclamation points by them. Let me do this. SOS! Chocobo in danger! The Chocolate signal is high in the sky, and she swoops to the rescue, but when she arrives, she finds two other Chocobo freedom fighters already on the scene. Bartz and Boko. They're here to free a group of exhausted Chocobos held captive by a strange black Chocobo. Alright, let's give it a try. Chocolate. Are you certain that it came from here? This SOS from the Chocobo sounds pretty far-fetched if you ask me. Yes, I know that's what you told me. But we've scoured the area and I don't... Huh? Boko, you sure that black Chocobo's part of it? Quick. Those Chocobos have been worked to the bone. You're right about one thing. We have got to set them free. Quick. Hey, Master! Did you hear that? That young man is going to save the Chocobos! Come on! Hold on a minute! That Chocobo is Hyperion! What is he doing here in Grimoire? Hey, Beaky! What do you want with all these Chocobos? <laughs> okay, here we go. So let me see. That Chocobo's got a memorable name. Seraphie once told me that there was a Chocobo of that name and color that the man a name for himself at a place called the Gold Saucer. Did I not hit the save point? Wow. Crap. I love amusement parks. Wait, how did you know it's an amusement park? I've got this. Good question. Oh, come on. Seriously? Oh, he moves quick. Quick little fella. Destroy him. Come on, I can't get a black chocobo? Come on, that'd be cool. The adventures log. Phew! We did it, Boko. But I don't get it. What was that chocobo's problem? Okay, guys. You're free to go. Oh, who are you? Chocobo Kalina! Just a regular old passerby, <laughs> plain as they come. <laughs> I have to say, you are really something. It takes one tough ombre to handle Hyperion. And I suppose Hyperion must be that black chocobo from before? I tell you, that thing was more behemoth than chocobo. And it's not often that Boko gets openly hostile toward anything. Oh, 
And by Boko, I mean this fella. I'm Bartz, and you are? My name is Chocolate. I can see Boko is very smart. That, and he seems to have the same keen senses as my master. Master? Hmm. Say, Bartz, if you're planning a long journey, why don't you visit my shop before you go? I carry just the kind of items an enterprising adventurer needs. And I want to ask you more about those chocobos, too. Wow. You should have said that you run your own shop. Sure, we'll take you up on the offer. Right, Boko? <laughs> oh, perfect. Right this way. Chocoboko ching! So I meant to ask, why are you able to understand what Boko says? <laughs> Me and Boko just have a special connection. Oh. That trophy, yo. Okay, so I'm going to save the game. Now, I think I could do one more. I'm t what now? Who's so? Um. What, five? What? <whistles> Chocolate's master. Chocolate is minding her shop one quiet day when Bart bursts in, all, all a fluster. His best buddy Boke has been kidnapped, and he needs Chocolate's help to get him back. Okay. Let's do it. We'll help you out. We'll help you out real good. Chocolate, come quick! Oh, well, hello there, Bartz. What's the matter? It's Boko. He's been choconapped. It's no. gotta be Hyperion. No. He and his gang are up to no good again. No. What? We'll help you guys out. We'll help you. So Boko's here, huh? That's amazing, Chocolate. I don't know anyone else who can pick up a Chocobo SOS. Oh, yes. Well, so tell me, how was Boko Choco napped again? Well, you see, I was kind of taking a nap, so I'm not entirely sure how it all went down. But suddenly, I could hear Boko quaying. He sounded unmistakably hostile, just like when we faced that black Chocobo. Wow. But I'm quite certain I would have sensed it if Hyperion was still around. Which can only mean it must have been something else. <gasps> Master, what is it? Huh? Bart's Boko's in big trouble. We have to go in now. Huh? What? Chocolate? How do you know that he? Hey, wait up! Uh oh. Boko. Oh no. What in the? Oh, Master! What? So you're the specimen's owner. It's about time. What the? This Chocobo can talk? Huh? What are you talking about? Chocobo go leave! Uh, no, huh? don't you see, Bart? Hey, just hold on it's a sec. Translated Isn't by... that the same chick that was sitting on your head? Whoa! That thing was alive? Hey, pay attention. Uh, yes, well, you could say it's alive, but... It's more like I live with it, so... uh, Stop running your traps! I'm trying to talk over here! Hmm. This Chocobo seems to be pretty intelligent. Makes you wonder why he bothers caring so much about his human owner. He ought to be completely ashamed of himself. Aww. And I had such hopes that he'd be a prime specimen when we Mecha Chocobos populate this world. Wait, hold on. Mecha Chocobos? Populate nice. this world? For far too long now, this world's chocobos have nuzzled up to you, humans. Isn't that the most ridiculous thing you've ever heard? Isn't that normal? Humans and chocobos are... I mean, take me and Boko. We've always survived by helping each other out. <laughs> what you call helping each other, I call subjugation. Hey, come on. Everyone knows chocobos are smarter than humans. Hey. It's time for Grimoire's chocobos to welcome the Cogna and become this world's dominant species. What are you talking about? 
Boko would never want something like that. That's right! And the same is true for all the chocobos out there! Huh? Who are you? Hmm, how very unusual. Why would you go and lower yourself by siding with this human? Me? I'm not lowering anything. The chocobos of this world are already perfectly happy without your help. You think being enslaved by humans is happiness? What a heap and load of phoenix down. I've heard enough. Boko here is coming along with us. You made a big mistake spying on us. Now you're gonna pay the ultimate price. All right, let's it's go. Not spying when you go and blab it all over the place. Let's do this. Fight the mecha chocobo. Whoa! A robot chocobo! How cool is that? <laughs> it has wheels. Two made of genuine tamamantium L. No, I think I this. should be the robot. Good idea. Oh, an imprisonable. If we did that, then we can dismantle him whenever he gets out of line. Okay, we'll go ahead and do this. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Berserk? Seriously? I don't think so, buddy. Predictable. X potion, I'll take that. Oh, there's a Moogle in his chest. Right there in the in the middle chest. Boko, you okay, buddy? I missed you too. Aww. I can't hey believe there, they wanted to rule the Good world with you. cognified chocobos. What a nightmare! That no good mecha chocobo. Yeah. I guess that explains Hyperion. I bet you that he must have been cognified by those scoundrels too. I can't even imagine. Ah! Oh no, yes I can! Oh, that reminds me. That chick perched on your head. It was doing the talking, right? You want to explain how that works? Ah! Oh, uh, let's just say. Oh, hey, you know what? <laughs> I've really got to get back to the shop. <gasps> Do you realize what this means? I may have just found the one chocobo that can speak our language. Huh? Hey, wait for me, Chocolate! <laughs> chocobo good <chick. laughs> Hmm. It's kind of fun. See, these interventions quests are kind of fun. Save the game. Let me check my Mirage boards. Yeah, see, there you go. Ooh, I can get some nice stuff. Is this good? Let's see, ah. HP plus plus. Hmm. That's good stuff. Baby Hemoth. Oh, yeah. Magitech armor. 
I think I basically maxed him out. Ah, War Machine. Magitek Armor A. Hmm. I have to look into that and figure that out. Um, Alright, so I think I'm going to be doing some more intervention quests next time. So that's going to do it, everyone. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel, leave your comments below, and check out my other videos. I'll see you next time, continuing on with World of Final Fantasy.